And my thought was like, I see that as art, but you could be opening doors to something that 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 can confuse the Christian community. You know, oh, that's just Lord. my. That's Which what picture I, that, are we talking about? It's it's not even a picture. It's just his IG page in general. His so, IG. Hold on, man. Y'all ain't finna drag my man's through the mud. He got one of the illest Instagram pages of 2020. I don't understand what that is. Okay, so this is a fire photo. I think he's dressed very well. Uh. I'm trying to find this effeminate picture. I have no idea what y'all talking about. This is fire. Like, uh, uh, if you scroll down one, I'm, they might be talking about that one where he got like a feather boa on and you can't see the rest of it. But you know, that's feather what? This yeah, the one you just clicked on with the pink hair. This. Yeah, I mean, I'm looking. That's the most. I mean, to me, because it, it looks like he has a feather boa on. But is this what you're talking about, Randy? I'm gonna strictly speak on this. I think them dudes are super fly. I think them dudes dress super cool. And I think if a lot more people paid attention and dressed cool, I think CHA should be further along if we stopped dressing like it was 10 years ago and no one had any fashion sense, okay? That's my opinion because some of y'all is so into, some of y'all is so out of the world, y'all forgot how to dress cool and, and your freaking reputation is taking an L because your style is taking an L. And I don't think that's helpful either. Now, I'm a fashion guy, okay? I like J's. I keep up with high fashion. I'm into that. That's me. That's just what I'm into. But to say that, like, it can send the wrong mess, like, I don't know, brother Randy, I love you, but, like, send the wrong message how? Like, I don't think anybody's going to look at a picture of Tommy Royale or Kid Triz and instantly jump into sin, right? Like, this is them expressing themselves. They want to dress cool. They want to dry, dye their hair pink. I don't think any of this stuff is overtly effeminate or I don't even know what that stuff really means like like if if Levi if my son hypothetically if he was 13 14 15 16 and was like yo dad I want to dye my hair pink for for breast cancer awareness month I'll be like cool matter matter of fact hold on hold on hold on yeah yeah give me one sec what y'all did to this yeah, man I got him started, I got him started. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh my god started. you hear the Cali accent coming out and everything no for oh, real all right <laughs> all right yeah, I'm a brother, sneaker connoisseur. Room. I'm a sneaker connoisseur. I just got these. Okay, Jordan, why not? <laughs> They're pink. Am I effeminate <laughs> now? What are we talking about? Oh my god. What are we talking about? <laughs> Yo, what you going with the Jordans? Right. What you going Yo. with the Jordans? These are fire. These no, are, are fire. fire they are these fire. are fire. What are we talking about? I can't wear pink. My it's first pair of pink man. shoes. I'm so comfortable as a grown 35, man. about to be 36 year old man, that I'm I'm copping me some yo, pink yo. Jordan Net I Zero three. Going the screen. I, 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 I wanted, wanted to. to. I wanted to. Yo, pay attention to the attention to detail on these. Like, no, come on, bro. Up. The tag gonna, is on the back. Yet. The viewer. tag is on the back. Hey, like, hey, what are we talking about? So, so if we go okay. by that logic, and I wear these in a photo shoot, which I wasn't planning on wearing these in a photo shoot, I hypothetically yeah. I wear these in a photo shoot, and some kid looks at, at it and says, oh, Ruslan's wearing pink now. Oh, my sexual identity is out the window. What am I going to do? Oh, like, is that, is that really what, thing. is that the same, is that the energy that we're on? Like, I don't, I don't, I don't get it. And it's not to, and, and I'm not cool with like demasculating de men or anything like that. That's, that's not what I'm talking about. I'm not, I don't think dudes should wear dresses. I don't, you know what I'm saying? Like, that's, that's not what I'm saying. Like, I, there's a whole, like a black comedian can't make it unless he wears a dress in a movie. Like, I'm not talking about that. I'm just, like come on like like yo these brothers is fly i'll pull up kid I, tris i've been loving everything i've been seeing from these dudes like shout out to tommy real he's a friend of the I, channel let's look up kid tris can i clarify though yeah you can clarify <laughs> you can, let me finish my point let me finish my point let me finish my point kid tris is a good looking dude and i am comfortable enough in my manhood to sit here and say yo that's a good looking brother let that man be the model type dude that he is dress super dope you know what i'm saying like why would we not want to see these brothers doing it you know I said i don't speak on people i speak on ideas let me go to let me go to mike uh profit link because he finally got some internet in a stable environment so here's the clarification this is the question i was trying to get to uh because of the comment sections right and because of uh and this was my thought process kind of like what you said about nf's music right when there is no resolution to the end of it and it's a constant kind of you, you have this influence on young people in particular youth groups right that's how you were pitched initially you build this fan base now you have their loyalty right this fandom 
and then now you start switching up and bringing up what could be questionable. I'm not saying these guys are questionable. I'm not saying Tommy Roy. I, I did have my own personal reactions to it, but um, what I was more concerned of was the comment section, of course. So you got comments talking about, oh, this is kind of feminine. What are you doing? Like uh, judgments happening. And then, of course, you got the cosigns from from the people who actually know him. And this was my response. My response was, I don't know this guy personally to even ask about this or even comment on it. So I won't do it. What I'm what I wanted to bring up in the question was, could something like this so broad when it's not when it's not clarified. Right. And I was hoping the brother in here, I noticed he does fashion. So I, I would have loved for him to chime in. Uh, I forgot his name. But. The question was, can this have the potential to influence in the wrong way? Can this be spark the potential for poor influence when it's not uh, clarified or if it's not talked about enough? So, for example, Tommy Royale's post, let's go to that one since that was the hot topic, right? In the comments section, people was like, oh, you know, you, you this is this is America. You know, people's getting hyper. They hi, they hyper feminizing men. And the dude is just posing in some fashion photos, right? Then you got dudes like, uh, I hate the name drop, but it, just for context and point of uh, point of reference, Gavi drops in the comment, nah, bro, do you, this is expression, this is art. Then you got other dudes that's known, uh, you know, highly known as CHA, whatever. And I get where they're coming from, and they know this person personally. Is there room there, though, for things to to go left or to go right? That that's really where I was trying to go with it. Does, does that Man, make sense? Man, this is the, these the questions question? is the type of questions that make me dislike a lot of the CHH mentality because this isn't even some. This is this is generationally passed down. This is basically mm -hmm. the can I cause somebody to stumble by not saying Jesus enough question? Can I right? And it's just I just don't think no no i don't i don't think none of this hurts anybody i don't think none of this confuses anybody i think i think this is i think this is dope i think this is dope like i don't know i don't i don't get it i don't understand i think uh anything can cause anyone to do anything and they can justify whatever they want to in their mind or it could it could fall off of them with, without a second thought so no, I don't, I don't, I really don't get it. Um, yeah, I, re I just really don't get it. And I don't care about comments. Y'all gotcha. know right, I don't right. care about comments. I'm the block king. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I'm the block king. And I don't mean I'm moving weight on the block. I mean, I block people on the regular. Right. Um, confusing people. I just expect people to be critical thinkers. I expect people, because here's the thing. Here's the thing with that line of thinking. It's just like what mm -hmm. me and I and Rescued were talking about. When you start getting into confusing and stumbling blocks, you, it's impossible to draw the line, bro. It, it really is. It's impossible to draw the line because what happens is for somebody, Tommy Royale, oh, he crossed the line, but then me rocking some shoes with pink or you wearing a pink sweater has crossed the line. Why are, right? So, so like the line becomes subjective and we're always moving the goalpost and that's not cool. Like that's not cool. Like if somebody is not promoting sin, if somebody is not glorifying sin, let them live, keep it pushing. That's my standard. You know what I'm saying? Let them live. Keep. And, and, and even if they're doing something questionable, you are not their social media accountability partner. I don't have any problem with it. I don't have any quarrels with it. I don't have any issues with it. I, um, yeah, I just don't. I just don't. I don't, I don't, and I don't know what, yeah, I think like the comments. So can it confuse somebody? I guess, but then that person, in my opinion, needs to grow up or they don't need to be on social media. One of the two things. If you look at a Kid Triz photo of him in pink doing something with his hair dyed pink or Ecclesia or whoever who I'm going to have on a channel and that causes you to stumble, that's about you. That's not about them. You know what I'm saying? That's about you. That's not about them. So, no, I don't care about confusing people because I am not like I am not a uh, I don't hold a pa pastoral pulpit. That is not what I do. That is not what I'm about. And there's people that could watch this channel. And they could watch one video and they could literally, and they have, by the way, Prophet Link, they have, Ruslan, you confused me. Ruslan, you caused me to stumble. Ruslan, this isn't helpful. Ruslan, th literally, literally, this, you know what I'm getting lately? Hey, you're not politically agnostic. You're anti-Trump. I never said I wasn't biased. I never said I was pro-Trump. What made you think in your right mind? I am pro-Trump. You know how many people, Christian people, were caused to stumble, that were confused? 
Yeah. When I go hard against Trump, 